Welcome. In front of me is a Realme 7i and today I'll show you how to hard reset the device through recovery mode and also remove a screen lock if you have one that you might not know the combination to. So I'm gonna quickly lock the device and you will see that I do have a pattern set on this device so I'm gonna progress from here as though I don't actually know it. So let's start by holding power key, selecting power off by swiping down and once the device turns off, you want to hold power key and volume down, both of them at the same time. And you will see recovery mode right down here, really faint. But as you can see, uh, after a moment you will see the language select, so simply choose your language, I'm gonna go with English. And from here you wanna select wipe data. Now, I'm gonna maybe move the lights a little bit so it's a little bit more visible. Uh, now, as you can see, it tells us to provide a uh, verification code, which it provides us right over here. It's just randomly generated code that you need to simply type in. So, 20, 31, and from here you have two options. So we have the wipe data, which doesn't wipe data, and then we have format data, which does what it's supposed to do. Uh, now, this first one is basically just redundant trash that, that litters the, uh, this recovery mode right here. Because if you read closely, it uh, tells you that it retains, retains contact messages, uh, photos. So basically, it doesn't wipe anything, making it useless. Uh, but the below one, uh, format data, which basically gives you no description, actually does remove everything, so that's what you want to select. So click on it, and from there, Click on format, which is this red text right here, barely visible, if even visible. And as you can see, it will automatically begin. Give it a second and there we go. Wipe successful, so click on OK. And then select the reboot option, or actually it doesn't look like we need to. It automatically reboots on itself. So yeah, now this process will continue in the background, so it will take the device a little bit longer to turn back on, but once it has, we should be then greeted with the Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that's actually visible. And as you can see, the process is now finished. You can set up your device as however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.